Godfilo Pabio, the Senate president, says the National Assembly, under his leadership, will give all necessary legislative bargain to the removal of petrol subsidy by the president, Paula Tinubu. Speaking during his acceptance speech, Pabio said the 10th Assembly will be forward and uh, ensure that legislative bargain is given to policies and programs of the president. I want to plead with you, distinguished senators, to permit me to offer special commendations to the President and Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces for the bold step you have so far taken, particularly in the issue of subsidy. If it requires legislative backing, we shall give. We must begin to produce own fuel in Nigeria. We must begin to encourage production of diesel and others in this country. And of course, if the stories so far are true, that we used to have 69 million barrels a month, and we are now having about 13 or 15 million barrels, that will show that we are subsidizing all the consumption going on in our neighboring countries, with which we can no longer continue with our very lean resources. So we applaud the federal government for such steps. We will try our best to also make laws that will move forward and encourage foreign direct investment into the country. The current administration has brought about the acronym of renewed hope. And I think this Senate will join in ensuring a total renewal hope for Nigerians where there seem to have been no hope. I had the opportunity of serving as a governor, and I warned my people who work with me that I, I, I do not still believe in politically motivated infrastructure. Therefore, the 10th Senate of the Federal Republic of Nigeria will ensure very serious oversight functions. We shall carry out very serious oversight functions to make sure that we do not waste the resources of the country. Of the country. We we'll put members of the executive on their toes, particularly the ministers, when they are ready to work, when they are appointed. We we'll follow project. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.